you have your very own domain, but what can you do with it? How about create a WordPress blog? So, let's install WordPress. First, browse to umw.domains, then click the login slash sign up button. You'll be greeted by the UMW single sign on page. Log in using your UMW net ID and password. Once you've logged in, you'll be greeted by your cPanel dashboard. Since we're just installing WordPress, scroll down to Web Applications. Under Featured Applications, locate the WordPress icon. Click the icon when you're ready to install. You'll be redirected to the Installtron WordPress page. Installtron simplifies the installation process for many common web applications. This page contains more information about the WordPress application. You, when you are ready to continue, simply click the Install This Application icon. This page is a form for setting up your WordPress installation. In the Location section, you will see a domain setting. Select the domain or subdomain location you'd like to install WordPress on. Then scroll down to the version section. Unless your instructor has told you to do otherwise, select starter pack for the content setting. Continue past the WordPress end user license agreement and the database information, which is set for automatic updating and backups, down to the Settings section. Create a new administrator username and password. Verify that your email is the administrator email account and scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page. Click Install. This may take a few moments, but WordPress will begin installing on the chosen location. After the installation has completed, locate the center link, the administration link, and click there. You will be redirected to the back end of your new WordPress site. Congratulations! Now start customizing its appearance and adding your own content.